All right, guys, here we are, episode four of rowing five for nines. Um, last episode you saw we got the turbo positioned and we got that janky manifold looking thing. That was just to make the fixture, which uh, we've gone ahead and done. And I'll show it to you now. Sorry. So here's the fixture. Made some scrap metal around. And basically it just holds the flange, the V-band there. That's on the turbo side. Centers it on this ring that I cut. And then just has a little clamp to hold it up from the inside. A little brace on that side I made. Allows access so I can get in there and do some welding and whatnot. And manifold. So I fitted the manifold to the fixture, made the fixture, and then I took the manifold out, got rid of those pieces of metal that were in here, got the V-band cleaned up and the manifold cleaned up, and I am gonna start making a transition piece now. And it goes from here to here, and then we'll bring another pipe off of here and put a V-band for the crossover to go underneath and around the back of the oil pan. So that's where we're at. guys well unfortunately my camera ran out of memory and it shut off um, while I was working and I didn't realize it so I missed a bunch of footage uh, of how I got here um, basically that last picture you just saw is this piece right here and I've welded it in I, I preheated this whole area red hot I used a high nickel missile rod to weld this after I put a big bevel on it you can see inside. It's, there you can see the weld right there. It's penetration all the way through. Um, and then this, kind of the same story, pipe. And then I just put a weld across there, preheated everything. And then uh, after that was done, I used a plasma cutter, cut a hole, and poured it all out. So this is the finished manifold. It'll get ceramic coated next. Um, but before I do any ceramic coating, since I'm going to be sending the turbine and the crossover pipe and the other manifold out, I'm going to send it all at once. Um, I'm going to finish all that up before I do that. And so the next step is I'm going to get this bolted into the into the truck and start working on the crossover pipe. So thanks for watching. <laughs> 